Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you enjoyed the question and answers video in English and Espanol. Today I wanted to talk about um, my favorite beauty product, mascara. Who doesn't want long, full, beautiful eyelashes? I know I do. Um, so I'm a little scared of getting extensions. I'm just that type of girl who's thinking about the side effects and all of that. So what do I do? Try thousands of mascaras. Okay, not thousands, maybe like tens of. Today I'm showing you seven different mascaras that I have tried, well five I've tried, two I'm still going to do, and give you a review later on. So let's do this. The first we have um, Mary Kay's Lash Love Lengthening Mascara. I love this um, mascara. I've tried it about, I think it was last year, and I really, really loved it. I also used the Mary Kay Lash Primer, which was great. Um, this is one of my favorites for sure. Um, I just love to try new things, so I never just stay with one product. So I'll do like drugstore finds or like more like Sephora brands and department store brands. But I um, definitely recommend Mary Kay, um, one of my favorites for sure. The next one I want to talk about is one that I think everyone has tried, or mostly everyone. Um, Better Than Sex Mascara by Too Faced. I hope that focused. Um, yeah, this mascara is definitely amazing. So after I used Better Than Sex Mascara, I started using Makeup Forever, um, Smoke Extravagant. Loved this thing, loved it. Um, it was actually one of my all-time favorites next to Better Than Sex and Mary Kay. Um, and I just definitely love the, the wand. I have a thing with the wands and they're so important to me. And this one has like a little kind of like triangle brush and I was really able to get in there like even with the little part, you know, to my shorter eyelashes all the way to the long ones. And one thing that I do um, that I find that works for me is I go down, right, all the way to the like um, roots of the eyelash and I pull it up like just kind of like brushing it up and I do that for all of them. The next one I tried was Clinique's. I put this on my Instagram. I don't know if you're following. Um, this one is Clinique's um, Naturally Glossy Mascara. Um, I got this from a department store, and it's good. I, I don't, I can't say I adore it. It's a good mascara. Um, for me, it wasn't like amazing, but definitely for like an everyday, day-to-day -day look. Um, I like more of a dramatic mascara um, feel. So for like the weekend or going out, I prefer things like I said, like Makeup Forever, um, better than sex and Mary Kay. This is good for like an everyday mascara, not a very dramatic um, eyelash look. The one I'm currently using right now and I actually have it on um, is this new one, my benefit. It's called Roller Lash. Um, and it's pretty good. I actually was a little um, hesitant because of the brush. Um, I don't really like to use brushes like this that don't have like the long bristles. Um, I'm a little. Um, I was a little skeptical, but it worked. It's actually a really good mascara. I can't say it's my favorite. Um, it's working so far. You do have to go in with your eyelash curler and like, you know, do it a couple times. It has worked for my cousin, it has worked for my aunt. Um, but for me, it's not like my the best mascara I've ever tried, absolutely. But I definitely recommend it for you to try. Maybe it's gonna be amazing for you. For me, I give it a four out of five. So now onto the mascaras I'm going to be reviewing. Um, one of them is one I'm really excited about and it's a Circa one. Circa is actually a brand new um, makeup line by Eva Mendes. I love Eva Mendes. One of my favorite movies is actually Hitch and I adore her in that movie. Um, I have this mascara. She actually has two. She has um, this one that's called the Absolute Lash Icon and dual focus volum volumizing mascara and top coat. So there's two I have here to try. And I love, 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 love the packaging. I'm opening this up with you, so I'm doing one of those unboxing videos. So here's what it looks like. This one is, like I said, absolute lash icon. It's such a classic um, container. I love the look. And it's one of my favorite wand and bristles. I love thick bristles. I love to be able to get in there and 
yeah, and really, 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 really um, pull, kind of like pull my eyelashes, like lengthen them as I um, apply the mascara. So this is the one I'm trying next. I got it in black. See, super cute um, look. That's that one. And like I mentioned, um, the other one is the dual focus. So this one says thickens and separates with a touch of sparkle. So that's fun. Definitely cute for like summer nights. Um, when you have a little tan, a little glow going, so this would be cool to try on those days as well. And last but not least, my drugstore finds are my favorite. Um, it's CoverGirl. So Lash Blast Volume, it's one I've had for a little bit and have actually forgot I had this. Um, so I just was looking through my stuff to make this video and I'm going to be trying this too. This one has a little bit of different bristles, if you can like, kind of see it. Um, they're short bristles, not my favorite, but like I said, with the Benefit Roller Lash, it works. It's pretty good. Um, so I'll be trying this one. So those were my top five brands. Um, I can't wait to try the other two and let you guys know how it goes. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Um, leave any comments with any questions or, or concerns. And also, if you have any mascaras that you love that you think I should try, please let me know. Okay, now I'm off to see if I can get some work done and send out some emails and things like that. So I'll see you next time. Bye.